the discussion topic that I led was looking at the biology of uh, fashion. Uh, so how fashion can be inspired by nature and biological organisms to look for new materials and new processes. We looked at uh, materials that they, we use now for clothing, such as cottons and linens and then silks and wools. Um, which are from natural origin. Then we talked a bit about the other materials that we have, which are nylons and polyesters. Uh, and then I showed them that in the future we might have new man-made materials, which again come from nature, but from organisms that we haven't considered yet. Imagine if you have a cow and the moment it might, feel, it might feel unethical to kill the cow and have its leather, in the very near future, and it's already happening in, the, in a company called Modern Meadow in the States, you just take a few cells from the cow, clone them in lab, grow and create these biofilms of leather, which is a completely victimless leather, so the cow is still happy. So yeah, they were a bit, I think, intimidated at first. Uh, it does sound strange while having bacteria as clothing. Not really, thank you. <laughs> and that's exactly the reaction that I got. So then we started talking more broadly a bit about um, fashion materials uh, and I think that was the point of uh, the overall aim of the day was just to introduce fashion and textiles more broadly uh, for them to understand what they are and also that they have the ability to make choices about their own clothing to think about how uh, nature, the environment and clothing connect. So we started exploring the, those topics in a bit more detail. The practical activity that we did was extremely helpful. Um, we had two shirts uh, that they had to choose first from a range of shirts. Uh, and then we had some materials uh, like dyes and fabrics that they could use to decorate the shirts. Um, the shirts were chosen very cleverly just as a, as a tool to get them to start talking through the play, through the creative exploration and discuss those topics a bit more in detail. So to get them to start asking questions and debating between themselves, which I think is really important as a skill, especially at that young age, to be able to just converse with your peers. Um, and if you're curious, not to, don't be scared to, un to ask those questions that you have. Also presentation skills, because at the end of the day, we ask them to present to um, their peers their creations and to describe the choices that they have made, the reasoning behind those choices that they were making in decorating the shirts.